And some sad news, too. Mm -hmm. We love this man. Everybody did. There's not a, he didn't have an enemy in the world. Gary Marshall has passed away. He was 81. He had, it was last night. He, he was here with us in April. He had complications from pneumonia following a stroke. Mm -hmm. And, uh, of course, you know him as uh, his sister, director and actress, Penny Marshall. He was very vibrant when he was here he that was day. So I mean, vibrant. And, yeah. And it was just so interesting how Kate Hudson, when she was sitting next to him, you know, you know, everything was deferred to him. Like she kept, she would look to him and it was, yeah. he was sort of the focus, which is the way it was with a lot of actors and actresses. They just wanted to be in his presence. Yeah, I know. And uh, you could tell there was just such great affection yes. between everybody that worked with him. Everybody. Loved him to pieces. Uh -huh. So he survived by his wife, Barbara, uh, of 53 years. Mm -hmm. And son Scott, daughters Lori and Kathleen are loving. Prayers go to them. These and are some of his credits. When you think about everything he's done, he did The Odd Couple. He did Happy Days, followed oh, no, by Laverne and Shirley. Remember that when those two and, were together? I love those back, Mindy, to back They were every hit spun off other hits. So smart. So this was Henry Winkler's one of the nicest men in the entire world, and he tweeted, "Gary Marshall, rest in peace. Thank you for my professional life. Mm. Thank you for your loyalty, friendship, and generosity. Larger than life, funnier than most, wise, and the definition of friend." Wow. Wow. What a lovely thing. That's beautiful. He what was your favorite? I, Gary I used Marshall to, movie. Oh, movie! I love Pretty Woman. I mean, Every, I that, universally loved. Yeah, yeah that yeah. was that was probably it was like the a perfect rom-com. You could, yeah. yeah. And he, but Beaches was so beautiful too. Even oh, though I still watch it when I want to when I want to cry for an hour. Mm -hmm. He did Runaway Bride. He did The Princess Diaries. Uh, raising Helen, Valentine's Day, New Year's Eve, and, and this year's Mother's Day. That's why he was with us. So he was just here in April. So we asked him what was the best advice his mother ever gave him. Mm -hmm. Take a look at his answer. If you're not happy, the way to get happy is make other people laugh. That'll make you laugh. Yeah. yeah. And he lived his way that. He always mm -hmm. made us laugh. We really treasured each time he came to be he, with us. We knew was, we'd have some. Yeah, yeah. You know, there's certain people that you always dream of one day you'd love to be able to work with. He was one of mine. And, and, he, and now, you know, you just think, I would want to be on a set with that man. And he was still working up to the end. He was adapting Pretty Woman uh, Into for a musical Broadway. for an yeah. upcoming Broadway yeah. show. So the family said he loved telling stories, making people laugh, and playing softball, <laughs> winning numerous championships. Even at age 81, he had a record this year of 6-1 and one wow. pitching for his team. Wow. That's yeah. terrific. Hey. Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there. And click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.